let's talk more about batshit Looney Tune Republicans. Well, we're, well, we started the show off in this realm, so crazy shit for brains, motherfuckers, Republicans, folks. So we have an oh, elephant no. here that's being held captive. Uh, first of all, I would like to start this program by saying I support elephants. It's a goddamn shame what the Republican Party has done to elephants in this country. Elephants are majestic creatures. They're beautiful creatures. They're loving creatures. They're emotional creatures. They're some of the smartest creatures on planet Earth. Right? Like, if humans are at the top of what we deem to be intelligence, right? Elephants are, like, top three. They're smart as fuck, motherfucker. Love elephants. Now, uh, Republicans, on the other hand... Not that smart. Uh, so here's a video. A Texas GOP candidate and former teacher. Uh, this is She's running for something. I don't quite know what it is, uh, but let's watch. I don't know any other counties that are more Bible Belt conservative than this district. And it's the Overton window. They have AOC in Congress on the left. And what we have done is become comfortable with what is okay in our society. I am not comfortable with the transgenders, um, the kids that they brought in my classroom um, when they said that this- Okay, first of all, I am not comfortable with the transgenders. I mean, that's a, that's a banger. That is a banger centrist, uh, sen sentence. Okay, let's just, let's just do it again, okay. Comfortable. I am not comfortable with the transgenders that's a banger. I don't know what to tell you. That's really funny. Uh, so she's not comfortable with the transgenders. And? And? Uh, cry. Like, I don't know what to tell you. Like, cry and whine, dumb bitch. What are you, little snowflake loser? Cry, whine, and when you're finished crying, right? And then, you know, wrap up your whining. And when you're done with both of those things... Uh, then maybe cry some more, because I don't really care. Uh, but anyway, the transgenders, again, that is not English. Uh, this is one of the problems with the defunding of education, um, in this country, is that the transgenders is not English, it's called grammar, uh, transgender people, right? It's like, you know, it doesn't, it's, transgender is an adjective, right? It, like, it's an add-on, it's not a, it's not a single word. But anyway. Um, the kids that they brought in my classroom, um, when they said that this kid is tran transgendering into a different... Okay, so the kid... So the, now we're talking about a random kid. So she's uncomfortable with the transgenders, comma, let's talk about some random kid's, like, genitals that no one knows or cares about. Okay. So the kid is transgendering. Again, transgender is a... Uh, it's an adjective. You are a transgender person. I am a transgender person. That person is transgender. Uh, it is not a verb. Uh, it is not a noun. So she's like, just like all the verb, like all the methods of speech, the forms of speech. This is a former teacher, by the way. That's really funny. So all the forms of speech she is not able to keep up with. So again, once again, transgender is an adjective. It is not a noun. It is not a verb. People cannot transgender into something doesn't that doesn't that's not a thing so and they said that this kid is tran transgendering into a different sex that i couldn't have kids laugh at them like i couldn't have um whoops whoops <laughs> I, I like whoops whoops whoa whoa okay so folks i want to start this clip at the very beginning here uh, because, like, this is, like, you know, like, when you're, like, you know, tripping or whatever, and then, like, you have that moment where it's, like, you realize, wait a second, oh, my God, I'm on drugs. That's, like, that's, that's what that's reminiscent of. Like, she's just, like, okay, so there's this transgender, transgendering, uh, uh, in the class, and I told my kids to make fun of them, and the school called me and said that my kids were making fun of them, and then I don't like that. Like, I'm, okay, like... And then she realizes, wait, what? <laughs> what? Okay. 
We're going to start from the beginning, folks. So she's going to transgender into a transgender who's going to go to town with the transgenders, and they're all going to trans each other's genders. Uh, and then, let's see what happens. I don't know any other counties that are more Bible Belt conservative than this district, and it's the Overton window. They have AOC in Congress on the left. And what we have done is become comfortable with what is okay in our society. I am not comfortable with the transgenders, um, the kids that they brought in my classroom, um, when they said that this kid is tra transgendering into a different sex, that I couldn't have kids laugh at them, like I couldn't have, um, like other kids got in trouble for having- I, I, Okay, I, let's- Folk, uh, folks, we got to turn our attention to this guy. So this guy is the unsung hero here. So I want you to analyze her movement. She freezes up. She freezes up, folks. Like, this bitch freezes the fuck up. Only the really... Like, I hate to say this, but those with the lowest IQ... So she freezes the fuck up. She has no idea what she's doing. Then this guy... Like, pay attention to this guy's body language, okay? So, let's all, like, we all watched her. Now let's watch this guy in the background. It's the same clip. It's on the same, it's in the same screen. Okay, so what, let's watch her, and then as soon as she freezes up, turn your attention to this guy. When they said that this kid is tra transgendering into a different sex, that I couldn't have kids laugh at them, like, I couldn't have, um... Kids got in trouble for having transgender kids in my life. I'm, I'm not, I haven't even gotten to the point where I'm like, whatever, like, her trying to bring this back, we'll get there in a second here. Okay, I just, I want you to, like, look at this guy again. I don't know if you saw everything that happened there. I don't understand. Do you understand why this is funny? I don't know. Do I need to explain it? But anyway, I'm going to watch it again. So she freezes the fuck up. She looks like Leslie Nope, by the way, in Parks and Recreation, unfortunately, but, you know, it's just the case. So she freezes up. This guy is like, are you okay? And then he gives up. <laughs> like, he gives up. He's like, well, that's not like he starts writing something down. Like, like this guy, like, like, he understands what's happening in the moment. Like, he's in. Like, she fell out. Like, she... She fell into outer space somewhere, like her consciousness dumped into the atmosphere. He he is still in, so he's observing that. And just look at this guy's face. It's amazing. Laugh at them like I couldn't have... Um... Like other kids got in trouble for having transgender kids in my class. That's why I vote for school choice. Okay. Okay. All right. So, okay, other kids got in trouble for having transgender kids. Okay, so, fact one, you are upset that your kids couldn't make fun of the transgenders, right? And then part two, she's like, all right, I shouldn't have said that out loud. Oops. Let's just tear this one back. Okay. Other kids got in trouble for having transgender kids. Now she uses transgender as an adjective here. So she finally, uh, on the, the fifth or sixth time using the word, she finally got the actual form of speech right. So that's actually an upgrade. So I think that's what she was thinking about here. Like other kids got in trouble for having transgender kids in my class. That's why I vote for school choice. And my opponent is completely against school choice. Thank you. Okay, so she supports school choice. Why? So why does she support school choice? Okay, let's, well, you know, you want to choose your school, right? So let's find out, like, what, what reason does she have for supporting school choice? So there was a transgender kid and other, so there, there is in existence a trans kid. They exist. Okay, so now, we, now, with, now that that's established, right? And then, not only is there a trans kid, but they're in school, heaven forbid, and other kids in that school got in trouble. And that's why she supports school choice. Like, what? 
<laughs> like, I'm sorry, like, like what? And again, I need we need to like turn our focus back to this guy, whoever this guy is. I don't know who the fuck this guy is, but his is I, I don't know. Is this a debate? I'm not sure. But anyway, again, let's watch this guy. That I couldn't have kids laugh at them, like I couldn't have um Nope, it's not working. It's like, not working. Like, I'm sorry. Oh, it's too good. It's too good. It's too good. Like, it's like he's looking, he's looking, he's waiting. He's waiting, he's looking, he's waiting. It's not happening. And then like, he has that face. I just, oh, it's, it's this guy. That's the hero of the story. But I mean, he's probably also a Republican. But in either way, like, absolutely. Like, what a world. Okay, so she supports school choice, right? Because kids got in trouble, and there's also a trans kid. Like, those two things that have nothing to do with each other, by the way. <laughs> nothing to do with each other. But there is a trans kid, and also, simultaneously, for unrelated reasons, other kids got in trouble... And so now she wants to choose a school for, I, again, I don't even know what to tell you folks, but that is the absolute state of the Republican Party right now. So not looking so good, not looking so good. Only the really, I hate to say this, but those with the lowest IQ. Not looking so good, folks, not looking so good.